Hi guys, so I'm going to introduce to you to the Tejada Beach Resort in Homalig Island in the Quezon Province. So if you're planning to visit Homalig Island one of these days and you're, and you're looking for uh, a resort where to stay, um, try to contact us. Uh, the caretaker of the Tejada Beach Resort. I'm going to flash. Uh, I will go. I'm going to flash her number later here in the screen. So for the meantime, I'm going to show you the entire landscape of the resort. So this is the beachfront, and look at that. Um, uh, Mero mga line of pine trees, ang kanilang ground, uh, very spacious ground, at saka napaka wide ng kanilang beachfront. At uh, yung ano yung sand dito, uh, creamy white siya, hindi masakit sa paa even if you walk uh, by foot. At uh, ayan, look at that, super fine uh sand and then you can um you can uh organize any activities here if you if you're coming um as a group um you can have your team building or you can have your family reunions or any celebrations um napaka wide ng ano nila ng ground and in fact you can pitch a tent here but then you have to bring your own tent kasi wala silang available down na tent and then the um yung rent yata ng parang magre-rent kayo ng space sa ground for your tent i think 300 pesos per night and then look at the ground meron pa silang hammock at saka maganda din dito mga kaibigan uh, ng sa uh, sunset viewing kasi nakaharap talaga siya sa Pacific Ocean and then um, this is the valuable court area if you feel like um, uh, doing some sports activities here you can play volleyball you can play anything you can have fun with your friends and family or loved ones coming into the resort so ito yung kanilang uh, Kubo area. Ayan yung kanilang pavilion. Meron din silang ano dyan, karaoke. Um, kung gusto nyong mag-unwind, no? After dinner. So, pwede kayong kumanta. And then, 100 pesos yata per hour. Tapo, and then, so, yung during our stay here, um, yung pinili namin, uh, doon, doon sa two-story dormitory style na building, uh, doon sa upper level, meron silang two rooms doon at saka yung per room, good for five persons. But uh, during our visit, apat lang kami. And then, um, very comfortable yung room kasi uh, meron silang two king-sized na bed at uh, kasyang-kasya yung dalawang tao. In fact, it can accommodate even up to three persons doon sa isang bed kasi sobrang malaki talaga siya. Ito yung kubo style nila na uh, na bahay. At saka, if you feel like uh, experiencing a country living, you can choose the kubo. So, this is the two-story uh, dormitory style building. Okay, so ito yung kanilang mga line of kubo houses. Doon sa inner portion na yun, um, doon serve yung dinner. Uh, kung gusto ninyo ng outdoor um, dining style, uh, you can choose this area kung saan serve yung meal ninyo. And then, so here we go. Puntahan natin itong two-story uh, dormitory kung saan kami nag-stay for two nights and three days um, by the way ang, uh, walang CR dun sa upper level so kung gagamit ka ng CR you have to go downstairs dito sa room na to um, in fact meron itong dalawang rooms pa dito ito yung comfort room ito yung dalawang rooms dito sa baba spacious din yung kanilang living room here we go let's go upstairs and I will show you the room uh, this is the veranda. Um, you can stay here uh, if you don't feel like going downstairs. Uh, you can stay here para mag-relax and then uh, mag-sightseeing. Kasi overlooking siya sa beachfront and then sa mga pine trees. And here we go. Ito yung room 
na na-rent namin. This a fan room. Uh, pwede din yan magiging air conditioned. Look at the beds. Um, malalapad siya. It's a king size bed each. At uh, good for two persons yung bawat bed. Pag medyo mga cute naman kayo, pwede na kayong tatlo doon. So, good for five yun actually. Good for five persons. So, ito yung ano, entire landscape ng Tejada Beach Resort. Uh, napaka, napaka tranquil, napaka relaxing because of verdant trees, pine trees around. At sya ka medyo malayo pa siya sa seaside nila, sa beach side. So, uh, you have all uh, the privacy na hinahanap ninyo kapag ka dito ninyo piniling magstay sa resort na to. And in fact, ano pala, walang restaurant dito, walang cafeteria. So, uh, kapag wala kayong food na dala, uh, home cook style ang, ano, ang meals dito. So, mag-request lang kayo sa caretaker, kay Juvi. So, um, magluluto siya based on your preferences. Um, tsaka masarap siya magluto. Um, napaka, napaka sarap na mga food dito. And at saka, ano, yung 100 pesos na meal per head, um, sobra-sobra na. Ito, this is the, uh, ano, ng mga, mga tables kung saan kayo kakain. Ayan, ito yung, ano namin, last day namin dito, nag-breakfast kami. At, uh, itong outdoor feel talaga, yung, ano, dito, yung meal time nila. Ayan, look at that, um, dito ginaganap kumbaga dito kayo kakain if you want uh, to experience some outdoor country living um, dining style so look at the environment uh, greenery all around talagang napaka relaxing niya and ayan yung mga kasama ko si Miko ayan si Angge na during our last day uh, dito sa Tihada na breakfast kami and then, um, I will show you yung sample. Ng, ito, ito, yung sample ng kanilang food. Ito, sweet and sour to. Fresh catch talaga to na isda from the sea. So, look at that. Um, ba Yung 100 pesos na yung sulit-sulit. And then, this is me taking my morning dip before sunrise uh, during our last day dito sa Tihada. Look at the, the sea water. Look at the sea, very calm. Uh, very tranquil, hindi naman masyadong malaki yung alon, at saka conducive siya for swimming. Uh, during of season, uh, walang tao dito. In fact, uh, during our stay, apat lang kami. Ayan, look at the the sand. Uh, it's uh, golden brown. It will turn golden brown, golden brown kapag ka, uh, noon time na. So, bead siya. At saka, hindi, actually, hindi siya masakit sa pa uh, Tamang-tama lang siya. Okay, so, if you feel like visiting Humalig Island, at saka naghanap kayo where to stay, so, why not choose Tihada Beach Resort? Um, basta, for me, talagang uh, very, ano siya, very ideal to stay in Humalig Island. At saka, si Juvie na rin yung criteria ang mag a arrange ng boat ride kung if ever na walang direct na na, tra, uh, na trips ng boat trip 